so uh, this is our lab the basics of google cloud compute challenge lab basically uh, what we have done in virtual machine a persistent disk and hosting a web app we have to complete here as well but just a part of it so in this challenge lab you don't have any uh, guidance or instructions to perform the task basically so we'll see how it works okay uh, we'll start the lab just the basics i understand okay so our first task is basically to create a cloud storage bucket with this name so we'll copy this name guys make sure you don't copy any extra spaces or less spaces uh, because it is very case sensitive so make sure you don't uh, copy any extra space okay be careful with the space we go to cloud storage and then buckets create a bucket the space in the name and just create it so yeah our bucket is created we'll check the progress it's done the second task it's basically uh, to create a engine instance okay again we have to go to the cloud shell uh, and sorry uh, console and compute engine your vm instance create an instance with name my instance again please take care of your spaces my instance our region is basically us west 1 and us west a is our zone so uh, region is correct we have to us west 1 to the zone yeah so now we have to uh, take care of the values and properties our series is basically e2 that's done then uh, this is e2 medium machine type it's e2 medium then 10 gb new balance persistent disk new uh, 10 GB balance persistent disk and the boot disk image is Debian GNU or Linux 11th bullet. So we'll just change, I guess, because it's Debian GNU Linux here, it's a bookworm. So you will go here and do the bullseye select C. It's now bullseye again back to the lab allow http traffic http traffic and that's it great uh, it's done now we have to create a new persistent disk named my disk with the size of 200 gb for this you have to uh, open your activate uh, your cloud shell basically so we'll do that here till then our my instance named vm instance will uh, will be ma uh, made We'll wait for some time. So uh, the my instance is made now. Okay. So the instance we have created. Uh, for this, um, creating your persistent disk by name my disk, we have to uh, do some coding basically in the cloud shell. So I have attached a GitHub repo link in the description below. So what you have to do is copy the first line or second line of the code. Okay, the basically just replace first US West A zone here and here as well. Again, guys, take care of your spaces. Then we have my instance name. Uh, our instance was my instance. Okay. 
then uh, we have the name of disk is my disk okay so the name uh, us one a us one a zone is correct now we'll uh, copy we'll just just wait for a few seconds guys and it'll start to create a disk of size 200 gb now it said new disk are un unformatted and this disk has been created so we'll go back and attach the disk to our instance jo our instance now my instance tha. just copy paste Again, wait for a few seconds and it'll attach the disk to our instance. Now it says updated. Go to their uh, VM instance SSH, view the cloud G cloud command, run in cloud shell, and just press enter. Uh, press Y. Again, uh, enter and again enter. See for this, like uh, this is the output basically now check for the progress i guess it will be completed yeah then we have to install a ninjic web server uh, just come again to the online uh, notepad copy all of this at once go to your shell paste press enter wait for a few seconds again till it has generated the and uh, installed the ninjic server i guess that's done yeah come again to the lab check your progress done so you have completed all the three uh, tasks and task was 100 on 100 just end your lab end lab here provide any comments Submit.